Hello all, I am Himang Pandey from the first computer science engineering batch at Amrapali Institute of Technology and Sciences. While completing my engineering degree from this prestigious institution in 2010, I got my first job at Edison Technologies, now named Altran, during the seventh semester at Apul campus. Never had to switch the company in India because my main target was learn and earn. My hard work at Altran paid off and I further went on becoming the technical solutions leader while earning the prestigious CCIE certification in networking. I further moved to the United States of America in 2016 and I'm currently working for Versa Integrated Solutions INC as a unified collaboration technology lead at the National Institutes of Health. The NIH is a part of the US Department of Health and Human Services and is one of the largest medical research agency in the United States of America. My primary technology domain is unified communications and collaboration, which includes all voice over IP, instant messaging and presence, audio video tech, video teleconferencing, email, fax and contact center technologies. Secondary technologies uh, are cloud, virtualization and data center. Tertiary technologies are physical security and cyber operations. I've also had a, uh, had a chance to work in routing and switching technologies too. Now, the biggest thing is that where are the computer networks today? Today, the world is seeing computer networks as not only computer networks, but also as smartphone networks. The network has actually extended to smartphones, tablets, smartwatches, and any other thing or things which are both smart and dumb. Now, this is really exponentially expanding the scope of what we call the Internet of Things or IoT. But the basics of networking technology will still remain the same. Today, the networking technology is going on the OSI model or the condensed format which you call TCP-IP model is going on the OSI Make sure that the various protocols that come across different layers of networking models are core to your understanding of how a network works. It is worth going through different RFCs to get a better grasp of networking protocols. Now apart from this, if you have a little Python or scripting, so you are all set to be in the elite most engineering force the world over. Now, the biggest question is, or I would say a million dollar question is, why do I talk about Python or scripting in the network? So it is really integral for you to understand that today, the networking world is slowly converging with the programming world and vice versa. Today, network job opportunities want you to have some sort of level or, or level of scripting so that you can automate most of your tasks. Now, Google uh, Cloud Platform and Amazon Web Services, for example, have learning uh, paths or advanced learning, learning paths on networking in order to land you in rewarding jobs. Now, at a, at a, at a recent Cisco's uh, annual conference, intent-based networking was the buzzword. Intent in today's networks is the culmination or it's a congregation of artificial intelligence and machine learning which are influencing networking as a domain. An example of how intent drives networks today can be understood with an example. Now, customer ki intent hai ki wo denial of service attacks ko kam kare, jo ki translate hota hai kuch security policies mein jo ki wo further activate karta hai on the infrastructure through open APIs and major networking vendors unko support karte hai. And finally, assurance jo ki बहुत बड़े बड़े amounts of data जिसको आपकी big data बोलते हैं it can actually take that and make your network anomaly free now this is basically the way uh, AI is getting into the picture and SD-WAN is a perfect example of this and finally after all of this prediction or to predict what may happen to the network in the future and comply with the customer's initial intent. Now, in customer's ka initial intent tha was to reduce the denial of service attacks, reduce the anomalies and make the network self-healing which is achieved using smart networks. Now this helps saving cost, it greatly improves business security and increases the overall efficiency of a company and helps it to do better business. Now, how many jobs available? Hai? So, as per Cisco, uh, there are close to 1.9 million powerful reasons or jobs to pursue a challenging IT uh, networking career. That basically means that your network administrator, uh, administrator roles are actually the hardest to fill. Now, how do you get in through the door for networking? Now, aim for associate level certifications, which will reward you not only with the competitive process and compensations, but it will also help you with on-the-job skills and what kind of skill set you will bring to the organization. Now, let's certifications. Ki baat karte hai. Toh, Cisco offers CCNA in several domains, for example, cloud, collaboration, 
data center, industrial, routing and switching, security, service provider, wireless, and cyber ops. Soon Cisco is also going to start network pro programmability certifications, which will be industry leading and recognize the world over. Microsoft offer karta hai MTA or Microsoft Technology Associate in different domains, jaise ki network fundamentals, security fundamentals. Now, if you want to have an idea of how to mix cloud with networking, do try the Microsoft certified Azure Administrator Associate. Juniper is a company which offers associate level certifications in automation and DevOps, cloud, data center, design, enterprise routing and switching, Junos security, service provider routing and switching. VMware offers its associate level courses called VMware Certified Associate. CompTIA is a vendor neutral uh, company hai, jo ki offer karti hai IT Fundamentals Plus, CompTIA A Plus, CompTIA Networks Plus, CompTIA Security Plus or if you want to complement all of it also offers CompTIA Server Plus, CompTIA Cloud Plus and CompTIA Linux Plus. Further, Amazon is also offering different uh, associate level courses like Amazon Cloud Practitioner and Amazon Cloud Associate Architect. Google offers the ACE, the Associate Cloud Engineer certifications. And now, mind you, if you have to have a solid network for the cloud, because cloud at the end of the day is working on an, a very agilent network for its infrastructure, and the cloud needs engineers like you and engineers like us to plan, design, and implement and operate it. Now, beware of several training institutes that provide expert level certifications without even going through the basics of networking technology as a domain. Now, demand continues to rise for professionals with the core skills that need to run the planet's most sophisticated networks. According to the US Bureau of Labor Statistics, networking is ranked within the top five most important skill set for business and job growth for network administrators are growing at 6% per year according to the global knowledge IT skills and salary report of 2018. Now being in the hiring panel, uh, you made a personal experience here that koi bhi fresher ho, jiski achi networking domain ki know-how hai and if he is complimenting himself with a certification has many more chances of getting hired than a regular engineer. There are several companies today that you can always search for online platforms to learn networking like Coursera, edX, Udemy, Udacity, Edureka, etc. You can complement your learning uh, on these sites and have your achievements linked to several job pools and portals like LinkedIn, Cvent, Glassdoor, and Honkos. This is Himang Pandey for Amrapali Institute signing off. Thank you so very much.